People who are 40 plus and happy with their life, what is your advice to people in their 20s? I am 40 years old and I have three pieces of advice for anyone in their 20s. 1. Accept that perfection doesn't exist. Your relationships will have problems, your car will break down, someone else will anyways have a better phone, a newer car, or a bigger house than you, no matter where on the social ladder you stand. Constantly chasing perfection will keep you permanently stressed. That doesn't mean you should not try to better your life, just know that if you expect perfection you will never be satisfied. 2. Pay attention to your diet and health. I have been working out at least four times per week since my mid-twenties. I am fitter, healthier and look younger than almost everyone else my age. 3. Don't stop doing the things you love. Even though I have a wife, kids, job etc. I still make time to play video games, draw, write stories, read comics, play basketball, listen to music, etc. There is no reason to become a miserable old bastard. Relax more. Don't get angry over little things. This. Relax and don't get overly angry. While others talk about material things or experiences the real lesson is to accept that things won't always go the way you want them to and that's okay. Didn't marry your perfect spouse? That person doesn't exist, align expectations to reality and appreciate those who love you for who they are. Or find new people. Didn't buy the perfect car? Oh, well, it still gets you where you're going. Define your criteria for the next one and work towards it. Didn't get the perfect house? Probably not. But it's yours and you can fix it. Didn't get that promotion? Don't be so sure it would have worked out the way you think it would have. Vacation wasn't perfect? Are you sure about that, or were your expectations too high? Point is, relax, enjoy the ride, work to your goals but remember none of it matters if you can't enjoy it along the way. I'm 40. This is my input. 1. Everyone is focused on themselves to care too much about their opinion of you. So fuck what they think. 2. Social media is only an illusion. 3. Zero debt is an amazing feeling. Think twice before dropping that down payment on that fully loaded 2020 dream mobile that offers nothing but looks and depreciates value quickly. 4. Falling out of love is perhaps more powerful than falling in love. 5. Use up all of your vacation time, sick time at work. 6. Don't lose sight of the hobbies you enjoyed as a child. They will help you live as you grow older. 7. Family is not necessarily blood, but instead who you would bleed for. 8. There are just as much benefits to being a night owl as there are to being an early bird. 9. Forgive yourself first before forgiving others. 10. Do not be a doormat in submission, but hold the door open in kindness. I was a raging alcoholic in my 20s and thought I would never recover from it. I never found a real job using my first degree or my master's. Part of it was because I was always drunk, part of it was the job market at the time. I went back to school in my 30s and found something I like a whole lot more. Now, I'm married, nearly 10 years sober, and have a great job. My point is, if you end up on the wrong path or don't like where you are, there's always time to turn around and change it. Too many people just assume they're stuck where they are and stuck with the issues they have. Take care of your teeth. This is the only set you're ever going to have and you don't want to neglect them and mess them up like I did. I've got crap tons of fillings which don't last forever and need replacement. A filling isn't as good as the real thing and filled teeth can break, requiring crowns. I have two and it sucks. Brush and floss thoroughly every single day without exception. Hell, get an electric toothbrush. See the dentist regularly. Ditch the sugary drinks. Unfortunately, I'm only 22 and I'm dealing with a lot of dental problems. For a long time I didn't have dental insurance or the money to get my fillings taken care of, and now I've learned it's more expensive if you wait and things get worse, than to get a $200 filling done. Start saving now for your retirement. Avoid debt. Floss daily. Exercise daily. Wish this was higher up. I could have set up a percent six pre-tax retirement account in my early 20s. I wasted 10 plus years and now will have to work another 10 years to make up for lost time. It takes a little adjustment but 6% to 10% pre-tax invested in the market will compound and add up to very good chunk of change by retirement. Plus as you move on from entry level to higher paying jobs you'll have established a healthy financial habit that you can practice until retirement and live a lot more comfortably. It's not a race. Stop comparing yourself to others. Just because they did things sooner than you, doesn't mean they're happier or better. Try to start good habits. It is a little rough at first, but in a few years it will be second nature. Do this with things like cooking, cleaning, saving money and self-care. 
It is okay to not like someone. It is also okay to have someone not like you, people are going to not like you for no reason. That is okay. It's a them issue and not a you issue. Don't be an ass to everyone and give them reason to dislike you, but also know that you are under no obligation to put up with someone else's bad friendship. There is no shame in seeing a mental health professional. When I was 22, an older gentleman asked me how old I was and then told me, Chad 303, when you are twice that age, you'll be twice the man you are today. I almost considered it a slight in that moment, but time has proven him wise. Here I am, twice that age and, in my humble estimation, twice the man that I was then. I believe this chiefly because I have learned that kindness is not a weakness, humility serves you better than pride, and cruelty is a fool's game. Also exercise, so you are not also physically twice the the man you were. Don't put yourself in ridiculous amounts of debt trying to portray a certain image. You'll spend your entire life trying to get out of the hole you dug or you'll have to declare bankruptcy. Set aside enough money to cover three to six months of expenses for emergencies just like now. Moreover, save now for your retirement years. It doesn't require much and if you have it taken directly from your paycheck you won't be inclined to not pay yourself first. Take care of your body. Exercise to maintain a healthy weight and good cardiovascular health. As you get older, it's much harder to maintain these. Enjoy the days of your youth without going overboard. There is nothing wrong with having a good time, yet if you are always waking up wondering what happened last night, why you can't remember how you spent so much money or you always have a hangover, you should tone it down a bit. Don't take advice or criticism as a personal attack. Most times the people who care about you have observed behavior in you which is off-putting, doesn't reflect who you really are or could be or would make you a more rounded person. Don't fall for the trap that your life needs to be one long narrative that you should be building. Life is best when it's a bunch of happy moments that just happen to be connected. Don't try to make your life into a novel, make it a book of poems. I needed this. Thank you. I always compare my life to a movie, and it stresses the hell out of me because reality is never like it, but I guess this is life after all. It's never too late to start again. All in my 20s I thought I couldn't just restart my career or dump a useless boyfriend or go back to school because I was already on a certain trajectory. Made my choices now I gotta make the best of it. That's total bullshit. You have no idea how incredibly young you are and how much time you have to do whatever you want to do. When I figured this out, I found the man of my dreams, had a kid in my late late 30s, dropped my entire career in my late 40s and starting a new one at 50 and it's awesome. Go have an adventure of a lifetime. Don't put it off. Make plans for your money. Stay out of debt. You don't need that new car, watch, handbag etc. Material items are not worth your sanity. Have a 3-6 to six month emergency fund. Don't waste time on anyone who disrespects you. Have a backbone but don't be rude. Not everything needs your reaction. Find someone who you can spend endless time with. Talk about ideas not people. Above all foo k what anyone thinks. You'll be 41 this year.